favorites so far, I think, of that one. I like that one. Love that sound. <laughs> She's the one. And the winner is... I don't love this thing. That right there is a rock and roll stand down. Yeah, I like that one a lot. This is my all-time favorite. It's a hard choice. Where's the swamp dog? Oh, yeah, I love that drum. I have one of these at home. You got to do this. It's like... That's the bow drum. Yeah. Swamp Dog is great because it's, it's fat and warm, but still is crispy. I'm real. This one has a real specific fundamental pitch to it. I'm really liking that. Yeah, the bronze is, is unique and throaty. I really, really love bronze drums. They record really well. Steel and the bronze have a very, very similar tone to them. Yeah. Wow, interesting, let's see. Nice. That is a nice characteristic too. Yeah, that reminds me. It's funny. The sound of that actually reminds me of Buddy Rich. <laughs> it's like it's got a like conventional tone, um, part of the old school Gretsch sound, indeed. Nice. The drum that I record in my studio the most is my bronze Gretsch. Yeah, there's a, just a tone, there's a, there's a pureness and a consistency to bronze. This is nearly identical to a drum I've been using lately that every engineer that I've had says that is a winner drum. These are amazing. Wow. So you want me to pick one of these drums to be my favorite? The Solid Maple was beautiful. I'm also loving this one considerably. Solid Maple was this one here? Wow. Okay, let's try the Solid Maple.